Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Michelle and here on this channel I do mommy videos so if those are the type of videos you like to watch then I'd love for you to consider hitting that red subscribe button so you can see every time I have a new video. So today we're doing something a little bit different, something that we haven't done in quite some time on this channel because it's been so consumed with pregnancy updates and I did disappear for my first trimester, but we are going to actually do an unboxing. Um, I feel like I haven't done an unboxing in a long, long, long time, but we actually just ordered and received our bassinet. Um, I actually ordered it from Wayfair. I don't remember the exact name of it, but I will show you guys when I open up the box. But we ordered it from Wayfair. I had such a hard time figuring out what bassinet I wanted to get. I was researching, looking at them, looking at the pros and cons and all those things. And there was one that I really liked. And I think it's called the Rockwell. I'm going to put a picture of it. But um, honestly, it was like really expensive. And you only use the bassinet for a short amount of time. With Mia Rose, I used a playpen because we were in a condo then. It was a playpen that had a bassinet and like a change table. And it was like extra large size. So we used that. But now it's at my parents' house. And she uses that when she stays overnight. So I didn't want to bring it back here. So I had to buy just a separate bassinet. So I went through a lot. This one, I looked online. I liked it. it the price is reasonable. Um, and so I thought, let's give it a try and see. So we are going to unbox that. Huang is here downstairs. So I'll take you guys downstairs and we'll set up and open it. And you'll get to see the bassinet for the first time with me. And we'll put it all together and see what we think of it. Let's get into it. Hi guys, so I lost all the audio because I, well I didn't lose it, I actually forgot to turn on my microphone for this, so I just thought I'd do a quick little voiceover for you guys and it's taken me a while because I was sick, but this is just um, Huang and I unboxing the actual bassinet, um, as I had mentioned before I bought this bassinet from Wayfair and it is called the Everett Rocking Bassinet. And it is by Isabel and Max. Um, currently, I looked on the website and it is actually out of stock. Um, but it will be back in stock on March 8th. So I will leave a link in the description below. And you guys can sign up to be notified when it is back in stock. So right now, we're just unboxing it. I'm showing you the bassinet sheets. So it does come with two 100% um, cotton white fitted sheets for the mattress that it comes with so that was the extra one and of course I'm looking at the instructions but like realistically no I was like I'm not actually going to be doing anything and Huang was like I don't need the instructions so that's what that was um, so I took out the mattress pad just to kind of take a look at it it's pretty thin um, and the material is kind of like a white like a wipeable um, almost like I want to call it plastic, but that's not the word for it. Um, so it's pretty thin, not super comfortable. Um, we actually use the Snuggle Me Organic inside the bassinet when he's sleeping. I know they don't recommend that, but that's just what works for us. Um, but if you guys want, you can maybe think about looking for another mattress pad, or you could probably make one yourself. So I've previously done it with a piece of foam from like, fabric land or whatever your um, like craft sewing store is and you can kind of cut it to that size and then make a sheet for it because of course as you guys can see it's a pretty um, thin mattress that's not super comfortable for babies um, but I absolutely love the way that this does look um, the outside of it is very soft um, and cushy but it's also very sturdy it's pretty lightweight as well and I love love the gray color it seems like it's pretty spacious um, especially without the snuggle me in it but with the snuggle me it just like it's like a perfect little fit um, but I love the color of it and I love exactly how lightweight it is um, I think I had talked about it being a I don't know if the word it, well I talked about it being kind of a dupe or a knockoff of a more expensive um, bassinet and I can't exactly remember the name of it I think it's the Rockwell um, and those ones run for probably about six hundred dollars um, so Huang is just putting it together it comes with a chrome base and then of course the gray linen basket 
um, that's quite easy to put together. As you can see here, that Huang is able to assemble it, just kind of use the Allen key and uh, screw in the pieces, the horizontal bars, and then you screw it onto the gray bassinet part. So it's very simple. Of course, it does some require assembly, but it's very simple assembly. Um, the only issue we had with it was that uh, Huang was having a hard time attaching one of the bars because the threading on it was not correct. Um, and so he wasn't able to get it to work with the screw because of that. And uh, we did reach out to them and they actually sent us a whole new bassinet because they don't sell the pieces. So they sent us a new bassinet free of charge. That's fantastic um, customer service on Wayfair's part. Also, don't mind my laundry in the back there. It's clean. I just hadn't gotten to, around to putting it away. But as you can see, he's just screwing it into the top of the bassinet. So that's pretty much it. It's all done, pretty much ready to go. Oh my gosh, I could see my pregnant belly. Oh, that belly is gone long time, but <laughs> well, not long time, six weeks, but um, so it rocks nicely. I find that the only thing is it doesn't rock as easily or as well on carpet, which is what we have upstairs in our bedroom. Um, it still rocks, but not as easy as it does on probably like a hardwood or a more smoother surface. Um, but it still rocks well, and it, and, it, and it does exactly what it needs to do. So this is what the finished product looks like, despite all the stuff in the background. But this is what it looks like. I absolutely love it. It's simple. It's clean. It's modern. I love the modern look of it and not like a traditional um, bassinet. Um, it's for uses from birth to 18 pounds or when your baby is able to roll over. And that's when they shouldn't be in the bassinet anymore, whichever one comes first. But I absolutely love the way that it looks, and I love that it goes perfectly with our bedroom, the kind of decor that I like. It looks well down, it looks very good downstairs in our living room, and I absolutely love that. Um, I also showing you guys in this clip the rug that I bought. I also bought this rug from Wayfair, and I absolutely love it. I love the colors of it, I love the design. Um, they were both actually on sale when I bought them, so that was really fantastic. Um, both super affordable. I will link the rug um, in the description box as well if you guys are interested in checking that out. But that is basically it for this voiceover. Um, this is what it looks like with the mattress in it and I actually I absolutely love it. Anyways guys, that's it for this voiceover. You guys are going to see my outro in just a few seconds. Thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing. If you like to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below and let me know what kind of bassinet you used for your baby. If you used a bassinet or did you co-sleep? Um, let me know your thoughts on this bassinet. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and join my internet family. And I will see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.